Okay, so this team was actually recommended to me a few days ago, and I wanted to go ahead and give it a shot. So hope you guys enjoy. Hit that subscribe, of course, if you're new for more content. You might be wondering, like, hey, what are we doing? Well, we're using a yellow-yellow-blue team, yes, but not exactly the way you guys may be familiar with it. We're not using Hit, and we're not using stuff like that, although Hit could be a good bench unit. Don't, don't get me wrong. Um, anyways, that being said, we're going to be using the, uh, not, not Vegeta, but the other two yellows on the top row, and then we'll be taking Bardock in as well to really just get our um, crit bonuses from the Go uh, Bardock, excuse me. And I wanted to mainly see how good this Goku can be in this meta in terms of like how things work. Now, previously, when he got his buff four months ago, something like that, I did do a video on him that I'll leave down below. You guys can check it out. And he had a nice showing. He was actually pretty impressive. Now, obviously, oh, wait, hold on. We're level 5,000 now. And uh, I don't think I soul boosted these guys. <laughs> well, that's going to be fun. That's that's going to be fun. Okay. Well, after this match, we'll double check and see. But I'm pretty sure I didn't soul boost all these guys. I leveled them up, but I just was mass leveling, and I don't think I remember to soul boost a lot of characters, so I've been slowly doing it. Um, but, yeah, that's a thing. So, okay. Well, I guess this will be our warm-up match. So we'll see how this one goes, and we'll go from there. All right, here we go. He did not bring Golden Frieza. I'm really surprised about that. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I'm really surprised he didn't bring Golden Frieza. He's definitely switching to the Red Frieza. He should be. I was, uh, I was gonna say, are you gonna switch or what? What are you doing? What are, what are you doing? All right, we're gonna vanish. There it is. Oh my God. I'm talking about me not soul boosting my units. Holy crap. That is a lot of damage. I'm over here talking about how I'm, uh, my units are probably not going to do any damage because they didn't get soul boosted or something. My goodness. Those crits kicked in, though. This is why this Bardock is still good to this day because the crit bonuses he gives Super Saiyans is nuts, man. I'll go for a blast. I mean, he did bring Golden Frieza, but he didn't bring the right one. I would have definitely brought the green one. Tackle. There it is. I would have definitely brought the green one. Uh, let me go for this. Stop the clock a little bit. Not a single. Okay, let me go for the rush here. Just get rid of this guy. I could have definitely saved the rush for the red. But I want to see if we can unload the combo on the red and KO him. So we'll see how that goes. Don't guess me. Every time. It, it, true to form, I get guessed. I'm not surprised. I am not surprised. Happens every time, no matter what I do. All right, here we go. <laughs> uh, he's at least a tap away. We got rid of his first life, so that's good. You're going to go for the blue? Okay. Nice job switching, because I was actually going to dash forward and just go get him. There you go. No. No. Let me vanish here, ideally. Yep, there it is. Okay, now I need to double switch. There goes one. Switch! Oh my god, it lagged. Switch! Ah, lame. Uh, at least I got the bonuses, though. It's not a big deal. It legit lagged off that strike card. I'll take some hits here. That's fine. Or I'll just die. No, he doesn't die. Okay. Oh, perfect! Stop ruining my charge step. All right. So we'll go for a strike. Not enough damage, meaning I'm just going to go ahead and let Bardock finish this off. Okay. Yeah, Bardock can go ahead and finish this. Okay. Or not. In a moment, Bardock can finish this. Oh, you're going you're gonna to do that? I mean, okay. We're going to let Broly take the hit. In which case, Goku might actually be able to finish it. I don't know. But let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. He at least made the... Uh, yeah, he should have definitely brought double golden Frieza and, and cooler. I would have ever done that. Or maybe full power. And that either would have been fine. But green would have been ideal for him. And there's game. Cool. So we're going to go ahead and uh, wrap, wrap here. Run it back. Um, I need to see how my units were, though. The crits were nasty. Completely nasty. All right. One second. Yep, as expected. <laughs> it was not completed. 
It wasn't completed. I thought so. Um, oh, yeah. So, yeah, we're going to definitely make sure that we do this. Because that's a lot of stats and stuff I'm leaving on the table. And for the people that don't know kind of what I was talking about, free, feel free to pause this screen. This is the main reason why we run the team the way that we do. But I definitely need to make sure that I finish soul boosting because I'm pretty sure they're all at the same spot. Yep, there we go. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. By the way, um, I did turn on my Wi-Fi because it wasn't on. Um, and that obviously was probably what helped with the lag kicking in a little bit. A little bit. It wasn't to where it was unreasonable or unmanageable, but it did kind of ruin my charge step a few times. So we're going to jump into our next match here. See you in a minute. Okay, so we are completely built up the way that we need to be in terms of our soul boosting, and we are jumping into our next match with the Vegeta family team. And uh, this one will be kind of fun, definitely kind of fun. So let's see if we can get the same result from the Goku. So we'll see. All right, and I assumed that he would bring the trunks because it just made sense to bring your green into the match. Not a single, so I can proceed. Vegeta will definitely switch. That's fine, though. Go for a tap and use this. Looks like he's sidestepping. Oh, green card. Okay, I thought he was going to sidestep. I didn't hear the animation, though. Is that a tackle? Ah, I, I had a strike, and I knew what I wanted, but I just hesitated, which is lame. Don't hesitate. Don't hesitate. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and switch out again, force the Trunks back out. Yep, figured you'd go for that again because it worked once. Bring out SS4 so I can rush him. Do it. Or not. Okay. Ah, oh, I should have saved that. He's going to go for a tackle again. I'll go for this. I'm going to rush here. Go blue. Yeah, Broly also is mainly here for SS4 Goku, potentially. He shreds any Goku. Dog. Twice in a, twice in a row. Twice in a row. Twice in a row. Both with blue cards. That's that's really annoying. Stop. Yeah, you're dead. And there it is. Oh, it's SSG Vegeta. I'm going to go green really quick because he's probably going to tackle me. Don't sidestep. I was putting the sidestep in. Don't do it. Oh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. Because I went for a sidestep and I tried to cancel it real quick. Smooth. His vanish was not back yet. It actually, uh, his, his vanish frustration is really good for the first couple of times after he transforms, so. Looks like he's letting me win. Yeah, he's giving up, okay. All right, well, let's run it back. One more, uh, maybe two, maybe two, depending on how long they are. But yeah, let's see what we can do. The main thing I wanna kinda mention is with this Goku is that he's mainly just a combo guy, actually very similar to the Vegeta we were just fighting, the blue Vegeta. Just a combo guy, but the issue with him is that obviously he does hurt himself, and that'll just never really be good in the game. But when he does get KO'd, he does have the ability to remove the enemy's buffs as well, so that is a beneficial thing. Um, but in terms of his output, apparently it's not bad. But again, he is 14 star, so there's some of that in there too. You definitely got to be aware of that. But I am pretty impressed. I do want to go up against a really strong purple though. I can't dictate the matches we get, but I want to get up versus a really strong purple, so hopefully the next match does have that. Oh, okay, this is probably it. He's bringing God Key. He probably brings that. Uh, maybe, you know what? I know people aren't going to bring purples to me. They're not going to bring purples versus me. I didn't even think about it. I just have too much, too much yellow. They're not bringing purples. Um, but the good news is half his team is Goku, so hey, Broly might finally do something. So that's, that's good. Yeah, he's definitely not bringing purples. I didn't even consider it. That was my mistake because the Super Vegeta is pretty much mandatory because he allows for not only more blast attack, but a higher crit rate, which is incredible when you combo that with the ability that I showed on Bardock earlier when I was doing slow boosting. So he's mandatory. Shallot as well. Uh, he's also Shallot's kind of bait, but uh, he's mainly here for the HP boost, which you really want, right? So that's part of it. And then on top of that, though, uh, the, the Vegeta was there to allow for my team to get access to a... Uh, 
uh, blast defense buff as well. So we want—I want to have every stat represented anyway. So just different things like that. I should actually have put LFS three uh, Goku there instead of GT Vegeta. That's what I should have done. But it's fine though. All right. Rosé's gonna come back in any freaking moment. My goodness, that's a lot of damage. Holy crap, that was one strike card. That's a lot of damage. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and switch back out into Bardock. Oh, hey, Broly. That was horrible, because my voice cracked. It sounded like a Wookiee. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on, bro. I sounded like a, I sounded like a, like a Wookiee, man, from uh, Star Wars. Come on, bro. At least the last guy didn't forfeit. I, I, I respect people like that. He didn't forfeit. Um, but yeah, when I saw how much that one strike did from winning the Clash, that, that was a crap ton of damage from that Goku on that Vegeta. That was a lot of damage. Um, we're going to run it back. I will sub out in hopes of maybe getting a purple to come into the match. I'm going to change my team composition a little bit. We'll be right back. Oh, you know what? I got kind of lucky because a purple was definitely coming into this match. <laughs> but uh, I, I did go ahead and slow boost the Goku. I won't be using him. I don't need a green. I, I could use him, obviously, but I don't need him because my opponent doesn't even have a green to use against me. So I'm not worried about it. Uh, all right. So we're versus a movies team, and this will be our last match, of course. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun for sure. He's probably bringing the normal movies team, not bringing Fury Broly. Actually, you know what? I think Fury Broly has a decent chance of coming. Considering I have yellows, I think Fury Broly has a decent chance of coming. Like, if I still had the yellow Vegeta in the front spot, I think Fury Broly was, like, almost guaranteed to come. So we'll see how this goes, though. This is our last one. Last one for sure. And if you haven't already, hit that thumbs up. Here we go. Okay. I was a little late on that, but that's fine. Bring you here. He's going to switch. Hello, my friend. Oh, my God. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Going to chain that. He's going to transform. Nice job going for a strike there because I messed that up. He's doing a lot of damage. I'm going to go green here and heal from the green card. Or blue, excuse me, and heal from the green card. Ah, I was about to do it, too. That's lame. I literally clicked Bardock right when he transformed. I can rush, though. I'm going to rush immediately because I think Bojack might be queued up. There he is. And Bojack gets really annoying because he heals after a set number of counts have elapsed. And I don't want to deal with Bojack, to be honest. We kind of already saw what this guy can do. Every match! Every, every match! Oh my god! It never ends! It doesn't end! It legit doesn't end! This guy doesn't know how to chain, so that's good. It literally doesn't end. Holy crap. At least I removed Vegeta's buffs. Every match, man. That's insane. I can't believe it. That's wild. This is a free KO because he can't switch. Oh my god, man. Every single match. Literally. What is this? Ah, I thought it was a green card. Lame. All right. Broly's going to get KO'd. <laughs> this is going to be the match where finally I lose because I get guessed. He's going to rush. He has a blue in his hand. He's definitely not choosing me. I'm going blast. Come on. At least let me guess somebody back. Okay, I knew I shouldn't choose blue, and I chose right. Come on. It's a blast. Thank you. Thank you. Come on, man. Come on, man. Every match, really? Every match. What the? What the heck happened there? What the? Stop lagging! Oh my! <laughs> okay, all right. That wasn't really him. That was me and my game being weird. Well, my my Bardock's probably dead, or not? Nice. Oh, 
And that should be a KO. Good game. Really annoying game, but good game. I uh I think I think we saw enough. Cause I'm gonna I, I think I'm gonna lose it. I, I think I th I think I'm gonna lose it if if I play another match and I get guessed again. I, I think I'm I, I don't I don't think I can do it mentally right now. I just I don't think I can do it. So I've gotta wrap it up. Um and like, okay, I understand like there is a way to not really a way, but you're more likely to guess your opponent's rush if it's something they haven't used for a while. So like for me, I'm choosing blue because I I think that it would be good to choose it, but in reality, I haven't seen a blue. So if I was the opponent and they hadn't seen a blue, right, then maybe they would choose it. And that's how I got guessed twice. But in that last one, it's like, bro, come on now. If it's a strike or a blast, it's like, that's, that's so hit or miss. Blue and green are okay. But like the last one is like, okay, no, 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 no. It's hit or miss. Come on now. So I don't know, man. <laughs> but yeah, he's, he's okay. Um, I still wouldn't consider him competitive. Like if I was ranking him from tiers, uh, with Z being the highest, then S, then A, uh, B, I'd say he's probably high B, low A in that area. Definitely a nice yellow unit if you need him for an option though. Also, but he's better off I'd say as a yellow team bench with hit as your main fighter. So definitely uh, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, hit the thumbs up, hit that subscribe, and I'll catch all of you in the next one. If you guys want to check out the video where he was far more relevant, we were also able to just shred Super Vegitos when he first got his buff, right? Four months ago, something like that. It's down below. Incredibly fun video. I implore you to check it out. Have an awesome day, and I'll catch all of you guys in the next one.